Hi there, Ann Stout with Remax Patriots and the Ann Stout team. I've just been doing some research while being stuck at home quarantined since we can't go out and show properties or view homes. So I just thought I'd review with you what I've been reading and why they're saying the stock market correction probably won't impact home values um, like it did you know, 12 years ago. That was due to the housing crisis and mortgage you know, falling apart with just approving anybody who could be approved, um, maybe, maybe some people who should not have been approved. And um, David Rosenberg, chief economist from Gleason Chef says, what 9-11 had in common with what is happening today is that the shock has generated fear, angst, and anxiety among the general public. People avoided crowds back then because afraid of another terrorist attack, whereas people are avoiding crowds now, well, one, because we have to, and two, just to contain the virus and afraid of, you know, getting sick. The same parts of the economy are under pressure. Airlines, leisure, restaurants, hospitalities, entertainment, consumer discretionary services in general are under, you know, this strain. And since the current situation resembles a stock market condition in the early 2000s, um, reviewing of what has happened, the S&P correction, you know, fell 45% whereas the annual home price actually appreciated. So in 2000, homes appreciated 8.6%. In 2001, they appreciated 6.6%. And in 2002, they appreciated 8.5%. So, you know, the bottom line is, if the current situation is more like the markets, you know, we had then versus the markets during the Great Recession, home values should be minimally affected. So. That's some good news and thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.